quick riff today. Let's look at Cochise from Audio Slave. It's another one. You know, the hey, coming out of Rage Against the Machine and into Audio Slave, a lot of their riffs are minor pentatonic based, and they've got kind of a it's kind of a straight groove, um, but it's it's not funky, but it's it's uh, it's really great. I love the rhythm that they use, and again, minor pentatonic just has that sound that you know everybody sort of knows and loves. So we're instead of tuning key over here, we're going to look at the two main guitar parts. Let's start with the main riff. Main riff E minor pentatonic, but not minor pentatonic up here or necessarily down here, although you could play it in the open position. It's these kind of notes. Okay, just think the dots, okay? We're doing E, D, B, A, G, and then E, okay? Now play it slow. Okay, so the first one on the beat is a very quick hammer on from the D up to the E. Oh, guitar tone-wise, quickly, I'm just using uh, I'm using a Sir Badger, and I've got a Bogner Ecstasy just to give it a bit of a little bit of I don't know grunt. F funny thing is, segue. Um, I find the guitar tone in Rage and Audio Slave is actually not that stored. It's not that heavy. He uses his Telly a lot on this one. I think he used his Strat. Um, but it's not a super overdriven guitar sound. The, the the fatness of it often comes from the bass. The bass is, you know, uh, Tim's such a great player. Okay, anyway, back to the riff. So hammer on. Okay, and then we're picking. So the D A again. Check the tabs. Little bit of a stretch, I suppose, from that A down to the G. Sorry, from from the B down to the G. From that seven down to the three. That's the only kind of tricky part. You could play it down here in the open position, it just doesn't sound the same. And I'm almost certain he um, he plays it this way as well. So that's that main riff. So that's the intro, the main riff, and the verse. Now going into the chorus, they just do a D, D sharp. Now I hear uh, even though it's a fifth string power chord, I hear him playing the fifth fret on the bottom string as well. So you've got a five, five, seven, seven. And that goes into that chorus riff. Chorus riff is really the only other guitar part. There's a, there's a breakdown, but you know, beyond his kind of intro and the breakdown, these are the two main guitar parts. Okay, so the chorus. <laughs> Okay, again, the same hammer on. And then we're doing A, G, open E. Okay, and then straight back up minor pentatonic, all dots. It's nice and easy to remember on this one. And that's it. Nice and easy. The two main riffs to Cochise. Good luck. See you next time.